Hello and welcome to this new video in which we're going to explain the rules of ABC logic puzzles and ABCD logic puzzles, as is the case with this particular grid. So in this 6x6 six six grid, you must place the letters A, B, C and D once into each row and in each column of the grid, and there are also two blank squares in each row and column. In an ABC logic puzzle, the rules are the same, it's just you don't have the letter D and you play it on a 5x5 five five grid. Now there's also letters outside the edge of the grid and these tell you which letter must come first or last in that row or column. So in this second row, the first letter must be B and the final letter must be C. So that means, for instance, that we know this square, highlighted yellow, cannot contain A, B or D, because if it did, then clearly the first letter from the end would not be C. Therefore, it must either be a blank or the letter C. Now, by using logic and cross-referencing the different squares within the grid, we can start to make progress and solve the puzzles. One useful piece of logic to note is that where you are told the letter at the start or the end of a row or column, then you know it can only be placed in the first three squares in that row or column. So the D must either be here, here or here, but it can't be here, here or here. That's because the D or the blank must come first in the column. And since there's two blanks, then it would be possible to have blank, blank, D. Now, if we look at this square, it's particularly useful because we're told that the final letter in this first column is D and the first letter in this final row is B. Therefore, this can't be a B or a D because if it was a B, then this couldn't be a D as the final letter and vice versa. Therefore, the only option is a blank, which you can either simply leave empty or you can mark with an X. Now if we move across then we can see that the final letter in the third column is a C, but we know that the B must be the first letter encountered in the bottom row, and we know that the B has to go in one of the first three squares of the row. However clearly it can't go here, because that would break the rule that C must be the final letter in the third column and therefore the B must go here. So those are the rules of ABCD and ABC logic puzzles. We hope you found the video useful and enjoy solving the puzzle.